Hey, how's it going? This is Bub. And I'm going to show you real quick why this is probably the only bait you're going to need for plastics in the Delta for a long time. This is the new Brush Hog, the new Beaver. This is the four inch model. It's the Psycho Dad uh, from Konami Baits. You guys can see the little side leg action just from jiggling the plastic. It holds a five odd hook. It's flat and thin so it glides. Each claw is basically a swim bait tail. So if you can imagine, it doesn't chop or swim through the water like a paca. It's not really aggressive. It's more subtle like a twin tail grub. These, these uh, super fat claws stand straight up. Every time the bait hits the bottom, this thing's gonna rear up. So if you land in a bed or if you're pitching into a bed and you're sight fishing, you know it stands up really good. This is the only bait with a sealed rattle chamber in it. It's not like a pocket craw or a tube or something that's hollow on the end. This actually has a chamber in it. It holds a magnum tube rattle, the biggest rattle you can find. And basically, you just slip it in the little tube chamber and it's locked away. It's not gonna fall out. It's locked in there. And now your bait rattles unbelievable. The side legs, they're flat on the inside. Everybody's leg faces down this way on their bait. They have no action. They come through the water and they touch the bait. When this bait comes through the water and any resistance from the water hits the bait, the legs pump back and forth. So it's almost like they're little fins or legs moving. It looks so natural in the water, it's unbelievable. If you're punching it, it's the only bait to punch. Flipping it on sight fish, just flipping down the bank. Unbelievable pitch and craw. Behind a punch skirt, it's, it's, that's what it was meant for. And if you're swimming stuff, and you're swimming the bub rig, or you're swimming the nose job, or just a chatterbait in general, this is an unbelievable chatterbait trailer. What I do when I punch it, I just rig a Texas rig. This bait was made for the punch hook. So if you have your paycheck baits punch hook, you're gonna be just fine. What I like to do is just get your barb just a little bit wet. You just slide your psycho dad up, and what it has, that little extra thickness up on the head of the bait, just to make it stiffer, and that's to help seat it in that barb. It was made for this hook and this barb to sit perfectly tight. This is a five-aught paycheck hook in a four-inch craw. It holds a five-aught hook and a seven-millimeter magnum tube rattle. No other bait on the market is four inches long, holds a five-aught hook and a magnum tube rattle. The rattle won't get in front of the hook point, you land them every time. This isn't a wide bait. This isn't big, thick, and bulky in the middle like a lot of other baits guys flip, and they lose a lot of fish on this. When you hit one, this bait's thinner. It's going to rip away, tear away. You're going to hook everything that bites when it counts. This is not a beaver copy. This is not a brush hog copy. This is another original design. It's available through Konami Baits, and it is the most awesome crawdad you could be throwing on the Delta right now. I hope you have one tied on in the Yamamoto tournament.